Alright, hey guys, and welcome to a brand new Minecraft PSP update video. And in this video, we're going to be uh, covering some of the changes made here to Raven Client and some of the uh, things that I've been doing lately with our brand new client. But before we get into the video, I'd really appreciate it if you guys could hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified of whenever I upload. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into it. So here I have Raven Client on my PSP. Uh, basically on my PC over here, I'm running a uh, normal Minecraft Java edition uh, server. And as you can see, I've been testing quite a lot. Uh, over here is just my normal Minecraft account logged into the game in order for me to do some uh, basic tests and to show you guys uh, basically what I'm doing over here on the Raven Client. Now, if I go ahead, we'll start up the Raven Client itself which should go ahead and get us into the recrafted menu. I'm gonna hit the multiplayer and connect to the hotspot, which is running on my phone, so that we can connect to the uh, Java Edition server on my PC. It takes a second and we log in. Notice how it's nighttime in game, and it's also nighttime uh, basically out here. And it might be a little hard to see based off the contrast, but as I look around, you do see that the color changes from sort of the base of the world to sort of the zenith of the sky. And either way, let's go ahead and find my player over here by slash TPing to uh, iridescent spot. So if I TP to iridescent spot here, um, I'm inside of the player. Give me a second. And now we can see there doesn't spot over here. Of course, now I go down here, and if I use the buttons uh, the, this side of the uh, PSP, it basically controls the camera movement. So as you guys can see here, we have the bot moving around as I change my inputs on the PSP. Now, of course, that's not the only thing. Uh, if I go ahead and hit these uh, buttons over here, this will uh, do movement left, right, forward, backwards, pretty much what you would expect. Uh, and then if we go ahead, our robot is moving ar around here, or our client is kind of moving around here based upon whatever the heck I want to input. Of course, it does modify based off of input, so if I turn this way, I will walk this way and whatnot. Sort of the gen general way that you expect it to work. And as you can see printed on screen, as I change things, for example, if I look to the right, it changes the yaw position on the Y. Uh, if I move around, it changes uh, the position in the top uh, sort of corner there. So now transitioning over to the Raven client on the PC, just to demonstrate that it also works, I'm gonna go here, click on raven.exe. It's gonna start up uh, with this nice little uh, sort of music that you guys can hear. Either way, let's go ahead and hit the multiplayer and it will load in in about a second here. I did just realize that I have left my PSP on the server, so give me a second here, I will kick myself. There we go. Now we can actually join with Raven Client. So let's run it here, and now we're in the Raven Client. We can look around, it doesn't really uh, show us too much here. Um, it's the same output as the PSP. If I look down, it's a little bit brighter than if I look up. Which, I'm not sure if that's necessarily the same way, but there is a strange bug where if I'm not focused on the window, it does do this glitchiness, but aside from that, you can still do all your general player movements uh, through the uh, client as well. You can go ahead and move, and everything is still the same as if you were using a normal Java Edition client. Now the next thing I want to add, of course, is going to be uh, chunks themselves and doing lighting stuff uh, alongside of that in order to have a much nicer looking sort of world. But that's sort of a feature that I'm going to be looking for for the full version 0.2, uh, which is basically rendering chunks and whatnot into the game so that you can do that. I also want to add jumping, sprinting, sneaking, stuff like that, other behaviors. Uh, and also on the client side, I want to add like the sun and the moon. But either way, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in another video.